Yeah. So I made it back to the edge of the sky. It's all class. <laughs> So next day in Chicago, day two, um, nobody's in the house right now, so I'm going to show you a quick little tour of what it looks like. Walk in there, there's lockers behind me, there's two sets of bunk beds here, three sets of bunk beds over here, and I'm number G, so this is my bunk up here. And then I also get a locker back in the corner that is G on it. And we're on the fourth floor, so not too great of you, but I mean not so bad either. And right now I'm going to go downstairs and get a ticket for the Willis Tower or the Sears Tower. So I can go there this morning. Um, they have discount tickers at the ho tickets at the hostel, so they're 18 rather than like 25. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm not really sure what I'm going to do after. I might go on like a boat tour. Um, probably like 3, 4 o'clock I'm going to go to a brewery walkthrough tour. And yeah. So I got my ticket to go up on the tower, so... I'm gonna go see that city view. So thank God I pre-bought my ticket because there's like a line you have to wait in and I already had to wait to go through the TSA, but I literally cut down the cap for like having my ticket pre So they say I have like a whole exhibit like on the first floor, the basement floor. So I'm gonna walk through that and they have like a video right now that I'm gonna watch. So exploring. So apparently this was the world's largest building in 2004. And I think it's out of date, but they said that it's still the world's tallest structure, so. Knowledge is power, I guess, even if it's lies. So, 103 stories later, in like 90 seconds, and the elevator was quick, I made it to the top. It's the south view. Here, it's gonna be the east view. And over here is the north side view. Pretty expensive. So I made it back to the edge of the sky here. It's all class. Pretty nifty. So I'm gonna go somewhere else now because the overcrowding is real. Can't deal with it. So I came down from the top of the tower. And first thing, my bag broke, so I had to like cherry rig it with my little like carabiner. And I'm in the gift shop, which I mean I don't buy gifts or like knickknacks, so whatever. And um, the air elevator is the worst thing. Like my ears pop like five times coming down. Like it's only a hundred floors. Come on. So I'm gonna catch a bus to Navy Pier because apparently that's a cool little destination. At the bus stop now, but it just, uh, arrives in like 12 minutes. So. Pokemon Go while I wait, I guess. So I made it to Navy Pier, which was well, I was like yesterday when I saw Ferris wheel. Apparently that was what this is. So I'm gonna walk around here because there's like shopping and stuff. So yeah. So it's $15 to go on the Ferris wheel. So I'm probably gonna forerun that. But check out this skyline view behind me. Slay that. I also want to talk about the robbery. There's like this boat cruise like over there or somewhere. And it pays like, you have to pay like $40 to go on a shoreline cruise. And I'm like, bitch, I can walk the shoreline. Like, $40 to ride your boat? No. So I walked around the entire pier. I think I'm gonna go find somewhere to eat because I haven't eaten all day. Because I didn't wake up in time for hostel breakfast. <laughs> And um, then I'm probably gonna go to the Goose, Goose Island Brewing Company, go and take the brewery tour. If I change my mind, I don't know, I might not go. So I'm almost to the restaurant I'm gonna eat at, but there's this crazy ass McDonald's, huge arches, and a fucking like green roof with plants actually planted on it, so that's really cool. There's actually like a nice McDonald's. I'd have to eat there instead. So I actually just realized that the McDonald's is right across the street from where I'm going, so. Winning, winning. We got a two Leos. We got a chicken sandwich, a jumbo dog, and a chocolate shake. I'm really hungry. Going on. So Portillo's is really good. The chocolate milkshake was divine. It was just like the ones they had at Taco Village back in my hometown. So that was really good. So I came two blocks, or two blocks, two stops west of Chicago because I wanted to come to a Goodwill that was over here. So 
see if they have anything good that I want. So that Google didn't have anything. So we went to another place called Second Chance Thrift to see what they got. So the whole endeavor of going to this other thrift store, store ended up being ruined because apparently it's torn down and there's like a construction line here now. So it's saying it's on Google Maps when it's there and it's really not. So you usually don't have this problem. Your Google Maps is usually really all reliable, but it's kind of a bummer. So on to the next place, I guess. So I came to Adler Planetarium, which is like right here behind me. And there's a really good view of the city. Over there's the Ferris wheel the one I was at earlier. And I'm just gonna hang out here and play Pokemon because it's like six o'clock and everything besides food places are probably gonna be closed. And I just stayed on that long ago. Yeah. Plans. Sunset in Chicago. So I'm making my way back to the hostel. I made my Pokemon goal to get a Gyarados tonight because I had like 300 Magic Carp candy, so I needed like 100 more to evolve. And there was a shit ton of Magic Carp where I was at, so. Finally got that done, so I left. And I'm gonna turn in for the night. I have to check out at 11 a.m. tomorrow. And my train leaves at like three, so. I'm sure what I'm gonna do, but make something happen, I think. So I haven't vlogged all morning, but I woke up this morning at like nine. I went and got breakfast at the hostel um, downstairs. It was like the same thing as the last one. Uh, I went and took a shower. I checked out. Um, I hung out in like their lobby area for like an hour. And then now I'm gonna go to Starbucks and go to Walgreens. And then head to the train station because my train leaves at three. It's like one o'clock now, so I have like two hours to do all that. I pick up some snacks and stuff, so. Back to New Mexico. So I got my Starbucks butter beer, and I'm thinking I need to get food to have on the train. But I don't know what will hold up well. Like I kind of want to get like like a Chipotle or something, but like it's gonna start smelling. I think a Subway sandwich would be okay, but I don't really like Subway, so maybe I'll find something at Walgreens I can take. Like I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So I'm at the train station. I have like an hour and a half until my train leaves. So I'm just gonna sit here. We got some gummies as a snack. And I got a Gatorade. Plus they have like other things already in my back from last time I saw the limbs and stuff. So you know, I just gotta wait. And I actually find any food because all they had at that Walgreens was like gross sushi rolls and like salads and I wasn't about it. So yeah. So I'm on the train going to Albuquerque. And honestly I have like two minutes of footage for today, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I'll probably add it to like yesterday's video because I don't even know. I have a one notion, but I have like Jane Corn Nosey. Like, I don't have one right now. Like. But yeah, I was sitting with another lady when she got off the last stop. She was pretty cool. We were laughing and having a good time. Me and Lifesaver got much. And we have like. 18 hours to go, so winning. Right. I also want to say sorry for my videos because they went downhill after New York. I just hit a rough patch when I was in New York, so that's what happened. So I got some food, I got a burger and a pizza, and I ate it half an earlier because I didn't eat all day. Oops. So it's the next morning and I came to the observation car because I couldn't sleep in that seat anymore. And because last night that other person put next to me after that other lady left like two hours later, so that wasn't cute. But I'm in here gonna watch the sunrise. If it actually comes up, it's pretty cloudy, so I don't know. But it's all glass in here. So. Well, I'm finally back in Albuquerque after like a two hour delay on the train. Fuck you Amtrak, just gotta say. No idea my sister and my grandma to pick me up. So, yeah. No, right? It's a video. Oh, uh, sorry, hi. Okay. Grandma, you're on the video. Oh no. 